Life is too short to play terrible video games. Unfortunately, it is also usually too hectic to play many games at all, especially the open world giants that have you putting in 100 hours at a time that are all the rage in gaming at the moment. As a result, shorter, bite-sized video games have risen in popularity in recent years, which, thank God, can be completed in a single sitting. Spanning a range of genres and platforms, these games offer an immersive, engaging experience that fills an afternoon but doesn't require a dedicated spreadsheet outlining your free time in order to complete. And most importantly, they contain some of the most beautiful and complete stories in gaming. What I'm saying is that size doesn't matter, guys, and these little fellas should not be underestimated. They can throw the emotional gut punches at unsuspecting players just as potently as the big guns. So let's take a look at some of the best, shall we? I am the short and sweet Ash from What Culture Gaming. That is a lie, I am massive. And these are the 10 best video games you can complete in one sitting. 10. Undertale Alternating at a rapid pace between terrible puns and then terrible consequences to your own actions, Undertale plays with and then destroys the conventions of a typical RPG. For that reason alone, you'll be hooked for a complete sitting. The strange and unusual characters only add to this intrigue. But be warned, unlike most games, curiosity here may very well kill the cat, and resetting will definitely not bring it back. Regardless of your actions, the fourth wall is never spared. Undertale will remember your choices and frequently flaunt mistakes right back in your face. Don't be fooled by the lovely pixel art and retro soundtrack. This is a game that is acutely aware of its audience and what it is trying to accomplish by deconstructing gaming tropes, which it manages to do in a meaningful and thought-provoking way. 9. Portal When it was released back in 2007, Portal was a breath of fresh air that gamers could not wait to huff. Aperture Science and GLaDOS, lovely robot woman that she is, came bounding to the forefront of the industry, leaving a trail of hype and cake in their wake. Playing as test subject Shell, you must try to solve increasingly difficult puzzles with the use of a portal gun, which can rip adjoining holes in the very fabric of reality which you can then travel through. Nifty it is a simple concept which is easy to understand, but can be difficult to master as the rooms become harder and harder to navigate, with a central narrative darkening around the edges as you go. Mastering the mechanics and trying to uncover the mysteries behind Aperture Science make for compulsive playing, even a decade after the game's initial release. The satisfaction of completing a particularly challenging or tricky puzzle will keep you entirely invested, planning to just take a look at the next room until you accidentally hurdle all the way through to the end. 8. What Remains of Edith Finch Following the Finch family across multiple generations, as each member succumbs to what may or may not be a curse, What Remains of Edith Finch is a darkly captivating tale seeped in magical realism. It is also set in a beautifully labyrinthine mansion, perfect for any mystery story. Edith is the last remaining member of the Finch family. Her first-person perspective makes every chapter of the larger story more engaging as she tries to discover the truth behind her family's lineage and supposed curse before it claims her, too. Focusing on finding artifacts in each room which reveal the circumstances surrounding the death of their owner, this is a heartfelt game, which is as full of life as it is full of death. What remains of Edith Finch will draw you in from the first sentence and refuse to let you go. The soft, dreamlike color palette and art style also make this a beautiful spectacle, which should not be missed. 7. The Stanley Parable Containing one of the most sarcastic and snarky narrators in recent gaming history, The Stanley Parable deconstructs the idea of linear gaming. It does this by putting you in the shoes of Stanley, a generic office worker in a seemingly dystopian work environment, scarily similar to our own reality. Stanley's mundane existence is soon challenged by the mysterious disappearance of his co-workers. This happens in tandem with the arrival of the narrator, who comments on each decision the player makes and what Stanley should be doing. Of course, there is no obligation to listen to the narrator though, which can lead to some hilarious outcomes. This self-aware game makes for a very enjoyable experience, especially if you decide to deviate from the narrator's instructions. The brilliant voice acting means every ounce of exasperation and annoyance can be clearly heard in the narrator's voice, as Stanley does whatever the hell the player pleases. With multiple endings, including some which can be earned in five minutes or less, the Stanley Parable consistently results in the search for more obscure and ridiculous actions to perform, if only to hear an omnipresent voice berate you for it as you go. 6. Limbo 
Though it has garnered a reputation simply for being an arachnophobe's worst nightmare, Limbo has so much more to offer in terms of gameplay, story, and puzzle mechanics. There's no text or dialogue in this game, and yet it manages to tell its story through some subtle, and some not-so-subtle, visual cues. The player controls a nameless boy who wakes up in this strange limbo landscape and through trial and death gameplay, as the developers have labelled it, strives to escape from this dangerous environment where literally everything is a threat. This is one of the few games to utilise sound effects within its puzzle mechanics, meaning the player will need to pay careful attention to the sound to make it through. It's an immersive, if occasionally horrifying, gaming experience, which can be completed in one fear fueled sitting if your trousers are strong enough. 5. Firewatch Firewatch is an engrossing adventure game with a delicious mystery at its core. The main character here is Henry, who for reasons uncovered as the plot progresses, has become a solitary fire lookout in the Wyoming woods. His only tenuous connection to human society is through his boss, Delilah, who he can contact through radio. How could anything possibly go wrong? Playing the game through Henry's first-person perspective adds to the sense of isolation and potential danger in this surrounding, vast, and seemingly beautiful wilderness. The storyline will have you on the edge of your seat as it progresses, as the woods grow darker with each new discovery. Managing to combine intelligent and oft hilarious dialogue, a tense mystery, and a creeping sense of pure dread is no mean feat. And yet Firewatch manages to accomplish this in a clear and focused way. This is a game that will definitely leave a last impact on you. That is, if you're willing to go into the woods. 4. Oxen Free Ever wondered how your life could have played out if you had responded differently in a certain situation? Now imagine you're a protagonist in a horror game and your conversations can inadvertently affect who lives and who dies. The pressure is on for Alex in Oxenfree to make these seemingly correct choices in order to ensure the best outcomes for herself and her group of friends, as they encounter supernatural events which soon have deadly consequences. As a coming-of-age tale, if the characters survive of course, the focus here is upon branching dialogue options, similar to the form formula developed by Telltale Games and the idea of cause and effect. As Alex strives to save her friends from the paranormal dangers around them, Oxenfree also examines realistic issues, such as the effects of grief and how relationships can change or shatter, despite Alex and the player's best efforts. This is a very unique choose-your-own-adventure narrative tied up neatly with a horror genre bow, keeping you sweating until the credits roll. 3. Thomas Was Alone who knew it was possible to get so invested in the struggles of sentient quadrilaterals? Thomas Was Alone accomplishes this impressive feat through story-based puzzle solving and a very sassy narrator, who does an expert job of conveying the varying emotions and personalities of each character. Thomas himself, an optimistic yet lonely rectangle who craves company, is a particular highlight, as he wholeheartedly believes his grown group of companions can escape their puzzling confines if only they work together. Unfortunately, this is regardless of whether the other characters actually want to cooperate. With a well-rounded story and familiar puzzle mechanics, this is a game suitable for any and every gamer. Playing almost like an interactive audiobook, Thomas Was Alone's story progresses in accordance with the player's correct actions. As more of the cast and their abilities become playable, it is hard not to become invested in the struggles of Thomas and whether he will be alone once more. 2. Journey The goal of Journey is as simple as its title. You play as a mysterious, nameless traveller walking towards an equally mysterious, shining mountain off in the mysterious, seemingly impossible distance. It's very mysterious. There is no dialogue in this game, yet character interaction abounds, as charming creatures made of cloth assist the main character. Players may also encounter other gamers as they experience journeys of their own, and whilst there are no text options, you can communicate through chimes and movements if you wish. Players can also work together to reach the mountain, or they can choose to forge onward using their own methods. After all, just because the destination may be the same, it does not mean that the exact same path must be followed. Part of the inherent joy in playing Journey is its freestyle sense of exploration and discovery. The highlights of this game, however, are the breathtaking visuals and ambient soundtrack, which shifts like sand to perfectly reflect the mood of an area. Details like sand sticking to the traveler's cloak create an immersive experience, which clearly shows the amazing amount of thought and love put into this wonderful title. 1. To the Moon How many games begin with the unavoidable and quickly approaching death of a main character? Not many, and yet it is the very crux which supports the plot of To the Moon. 
The idea of traveling through a dying man's memories in order to fulfill his final wish may not be a conventional idea for a video game plot. However, this game does not shy away from tugging on many a heartstring, as a player works alongside Dr. Rosaline and Dr. Watts to unravel the mysteries behind Johnny and River's joint past. Why is Johnny's final wish to go to the moon? How can the doctors possibly manage to make this dream seem possible? Can anyone play this game without getting slightly choked up? All of these questions and more are answered through a compelling masterclass in storytelling, which is only enhanced by the charming pixel art. The captivating and memorable soundtrack successfully leaves as much of an impact as the game's small cast of quirky yet realistic characters, too. Even the most hard-hearted of players will find it difficult to tear themselves away, as they and the characters strive towards their goal of getting to the moon. Prepare the box of tissues, my friends, as this one will leave you in knots. And that's our list. What other video games have you happily spent an afternoon on? Share your thoughts in the comments section below. I've been Ash, and this has been Rock Culture Gaming. Don't forget to like, share, subscribe, and come back again soon for some more quickie content. Thanks for watching.